This morning, firefighters in South Lake Tahoe are the last line of defense between the massive Caldor fire and thousands of homes. The fire has been very volatile. Every time we think we're getting a foothold on getting some containment lines put in, it shows us that it's going to do what it wants. The fire's massive smoke spreading into neighboring states as it threatens Lake Tahoe. A summer paradise known for its turquoise waters now shrouded in smoke and flame. I'm wondering if I'm going to have a home to come, you know, back to. The inferno quickly closing in on the resort town. Homes are threatened and our community is threatened and I never thought that that was possible. Hundreds of structures already destroyed, more than 30,000 others now under threat, with more than 50,000 residents under mandatory evacuation. When you evacuate, you realize how many things you left behind, uh, but it's too late. You evacuate, you can't get back in. Ahead of a typically busy Labor Day weekend, residents and visitors are instead fleeing. It's heartbreaking. It's just unfortunate. Yeah. Just lots of family and years of memories, and it just, it's absolutely devastating. Others choosing to stay behind for now. As long as the smoke isn't so bad and the flames aren't real close, we're going to stick it out, you know. But if not, we'll, uh, we'll hightail it out. Burning nearly 200,000 acres, massive smoke plumes can be seen from miles away. On the ground, red hot flames devouring dry brush and tall trees. These evacuees are getting ready to move yet again. This center, 40 miles from South Lake Tahoe, is now sending Californians seeking shelter another 50 miles away to Reno, Nevada. And this moving kicks the daylights out of me. It's tough. It's very tough, emotional. It's a battle against the blaze, with relief hard to see amid the heavy haze. It's erratic. This fire continues to grow. We continue to fight, but this community is still at risk very much so. Today, those crews battling the flames are going to have to dig deep for stamina because with the heavy winds and high temperatures moving in and those red flag warnings, which are so dangerous to this fire, this is a crucial moment for the overall firefight. Yeah, back heroic to efforts by those firefighters, Steve Wow.